Hello, this is Rebecca McGillicuddy with Baroque Planning. Happy March. I wanted to share with you a few things. This is, yes, my follow-up to setting up my classes and my work schedule planners. And as I explained before in previous videos, I have a specific system and a specific reason why I do what I do. Funny thing is, my husband just came to me this morning and said, you know, you explained to me why you do the journaling and yet you don't explain it that way to anybody else. So, though I know I have a video on this channel that states I don't do certain things because at the time it's not me. Well, it seems now it may just wind up being me. I still don't think I'm going to go and do anything more than um, my normal, but I am going to try and record how I do my days. When, why, where, all of that. If that seems like something you might be interested in, let me know. And please, ask me questions. I don't mind answering the questions. Um, maybe you're going through something that I'm going through, you're, or you're trying to figure out why I'm doing something. Because I just have not mentioned it because maybe I thought I had. I'm doing a lot of because today. I think that's okay. One of the things that I will say over and over is for me, planning is relaxing. I know that that is silly to some people, confusing to others, but planning truly is relaxing for me. And when I'm trying to do shorts, there's very little that I'm able to show you, share with you, because I'm trying to get something in in a specific time frame. I will continue doing my shorts, but maybe not so much information being sped through, but maybe a little bit of information, and then we can do some longer videos not all day, but a little longer, like this one. And I can go into a little bit more of a detail. It's not easy for me to share, only in the fact that I am an introvert. And being that, doing what everybody else is doing is also something that doesn't work for me. Now it looks like I am doing what everybody else is doing, but I'm doing it in my little way that makes me feel it's different. I hope you're trying to do your planning and memory keeping in your own way. I do take inspiration by seeing what others are doing. But I don't necessarily need to do it myself. One thing about being an artist that I very much enjoy is the fact that I can admire what someone else has accomplished. 
Not that others don't admire that. Please don't take that wrong. But it's just something that I know deep inside that it's a blessing and an honor to be able to look at someone else's work or what someone else has done and be amazed because I didn't think about that. And it's okay that I didn't because they helped to inspire me and what I do. I hope I can inspire you. I hope this is not something that is stressful. And I hope I can give you some information. Here in the month of March, I will be introducing new chapters and new ideas and thoughts. So I'll see you in March, and I hope you have a great month. Stay healthy, stay safe, and by all means, stay warm.